Did castration affect your penis uh, size at all? It did. So it shrunk. It shrunk about like over an inch. Honestly, I used to be like six, six and a half, and mm-hmm. now I'm like a solid five. Mm-hmm. And do you care about that? I mean. I do only because when a director is like more length, I'm like, go underneath <laughs> because I cannot pull out anymore. <laughs> so it is nice. Like I was so insecure about my dick size until in my personal life, I started making like a lot of like girls squirt mm-hmm. and like a lot of girls like come and they're just like, no, your dick is like great. Mm-hmm. And it's because like it's small. It's, well, it's not small. It's average. It's average. Uh, but it's like curved right up. So it okay. curves like the, So that's like the perfect size for both men and women. Mm-hmm. So it hits your prostate or hits your G spot. And so like when I, in my personal life, when I started making people come, like I became more of a top throughout my porn career. Mm-hmm. That was when I was like, oh, actually it is a nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I'm sure as you know, like so many men base their sense of masculinity around the size of their dick, you know, I mean, and constantly. Sorry, do you have a tissue? I used to. Mm -hmm. I feel like before, well, even before my transition, I feel like I was like a complete and utter bottom. Like I only Mm. like dick. I was like never, ever topped. And then like throughout my transition and throughout porn, I really like, I don't really bottom as much as anymore as I used to. Uh, And it's it's just a lot of work, honestly. (laughs) Bottoming is so, a lot of work. Bottoming is a lot of work. I'd rather top. And so, so how how is bottoming more work? Bottom because you got to clean out, and also it's like I feel like you have to be really in the mood, mm-hmm. and I feel like working and bottoming for like porn. I feel like it kind of like lost its like luster mm-hmm. for me. I think that topping is just better because I'm more I like being in control. Okay. Plus, I feel like with my fans, I um, have a lot of like guys who want to be submissive or like that are like like sissification or like humiliation and I've really like started liking that in my personal life mm. uh, my go to porn when I first started porn was POV anal like I love watching like like a girl take it in her ass because like mm-hmm. it's different for her because like she's a pussy so it's like it feels like it's like naughtier mm-hmm. but then now I watch a lot of like cuckold, <laughs> cuckold. Mm-hmm. Uh, and it's just nice and like it's just hot mm-hmm. so it like fits with your personality yeah. more right so you prefer to top yeah do you do you bottom at all anymore or I do you do. get to I think choose I, I bottom for like people that I like and mm-hmm. then also I don't know I, I really have been loving getting strapped on like a girl okay uh, so April Olsen took my strap virginity two years ago okay. on Jim Power set. And then uh, Emma Magnolia, uh, we just had a scene where she topped with the strap on. And so I really want to uh, explore that side of my life. Mm-hmm. Uh, I just broke up, well, not just, I broke up with my ex back in February. And like one of the big reasons for him, I told him, was like, I just need someone more queer. Mm-hmm. So I cannot be with a straight guy anymore. I can't be with like, a full like lesbian. I need someone who is like bisexual, who's versatile, who's open. Mm-hmm. I need someone who's just like me to really just like like to explore and like do everything. Hey guys, if you want to support my show, then you should think about joining my Patreon. At my Patreon, I offer all kinds of amazing perks in exchange for your financial support. From live streams of my interviews as they are happening, to bonus Q and A's, behind the scenes photos and videos of my shoots, plus cool merch like stickers, mugs, and hoodies, we have you covered. So go to patreon.com slash hollyrandallunfiltered, and while you're at it, make sure that you click that subscribe button so you don't miss a single one of my new updates.